we have practical exam day and we are starting at the Esso gas station in Bad Soden am Taunus and we will come back to the Esso gas station in Bad Soden. So bitte links abbiegen, please turn left. We are leaving the private property. So we have to check pedestrians first, then we have to check the crossing street and because we are a left turner we have to see that there is no oncoming traffic from the other private parking lot on the other side. Here's our spot and we are in the game, on the road. Please drive into the roundabout and take exit number one. Bitte fahren Sie die erste Ausfahrt aus dem Kreisel raus. Or you also can say, bitte verlassen Sie den Kreisel an der ersten Ausfahrt. So we saw the 30s sign. Here is another one, if you forgot in the meantime. Bitte links abbiegen. So turning left means only oncoming traffic has the priority, but the traffic light on the other side is red. It's green for the pedestrians, so it's impossible that the oncoming traffic has green light right now. And another 30 sign after the turn. Green pedestrian traffic light number two, because on the right side is a primary school and they need some traffic lights. So there are white block lines on ground, that's for right before left, so slowing down, checking the right street, nobody coming and going on. 30 again. And from here you can probably already see the walking speed area sign, low traffic zone. Speed limit 4 to 7, it must be clearly below 10 and all pedestrians have the priority. If someone wants to cross, we have to stop and let them go. Speed is down, no pedestrians to cross, so we just enjoy the race through this area. Am Ende bitte rechts abbiegen. Please turn right. We are leaving a walking speed area, which means we have to let everyone go. So we check the left side and we check the right side and then blind spot and we can turn right. And 30 again. So you see directly behind you have turned, you have to see if there are any signs because otherwise you are screwed up, you don't know what happens. Nächste Straße links abbiegen, please turn left. Behind the traffic light on the right side is a priority sign for us. And here he is hesitating and checking the right side, that was not so good, but he waited for the left turn, no problem. Blind spot, turn. And 30 zone. This time it's a zone, it's an area, not, not just for that street. And please turn right, bitte rechts abbiegen. Or he can say, nächste rechts. Nice curve to the right side. And mirror indicator, blind spot passing the parked car. Because of the bend to the left, left side, he was going back to the right side and passing the next two cars. So 
So from here you already can see a no entry sign and he saw it very early so he asked links oder rechts and the examiner said rechts bitte. So we prepared to turn right. Staying on the right side, staying behind the parked cars, checking if someone is coming, bicycle only, and then mirror, indicator, blind spot, and passing. Rechts abbiegen. Nice distance to the parked cars. Slow approach to the priority road. Checking. Crossroad and waiting for the spot. Oncoming traffic also hesitates. One more and we are out. Thirty is the speed limit and we see the priority sign for one street so we have the priority we can go on another 30 sign on the side traffic light for pedestrians uh, is red and for us it's green we can go on the left, left side is the street where we just came out and this time we went straight to see some other streets Then we have a pedestrian crossing, left side clearly free, right side clearly free, clearly free. Wow, that's <laughs> complicated. Clearly free. Bitte links abbiegen an der Ampel. Ampel is the traffic light. Bitte biegen Sie an der Ampel nach links ab. The sign on the right side says bei rot hier halten. If it's red light, please stop here. It's a little bit far away, but the line is on the ground. If there is probably a bus or a truck coming from the left street turning into our street, they need space for their big uh, vehicle. And that's why they put the stop line a little bit earlier. So because we turn left, we just have to check the pedestrians behind our uh, left turn. Oncoming traffic is coming out of a, uh, a low traffic zone. They don't have a traffic light over there so we don't need to check the oncoming traffic. Only the left side pedestrians. Mirror, blind spot, turn. No pedestrians there, we go on. On the side was a third design with a Additional sign only between 22 o'clock, so that's 10 in the evening and 6 in the morning. That's why 30 is not valid. Here it is again. Bitte fahren Sie in den Kreisel rein und nehmen Sie die zweite Ausfahrt. Second exit. So checking what's coming from the left side. The black car is waiting, the white truck is a little bit away and he's indicating which is not visible from here. And we are in. Exit number one, mirror, indicator, blind spot, exit number two, zweite Ausfahrt. And there she is, the Esso gas station. But it's too early to come back, we have to do some things. 
Yeah, now we are on a priority road here. Again, it's a traffic light just for pedestrians. little traffic jam and if there's traffic jam remember you have to keep some things free you should not stand on intersections or on rail crosses or on the pedestrian crossings that's not allowed so you always need so much distance to the front car that you can react about the traffic jam so if the speed is going down you should uh, let your distance to the front car grow and the bigger the car in front of you is the more distance I would take because you see nothing except of the car in front of you. Green traffic light speed limit is 50 and two lanes going straight and of course we go straight if the examiner doesn't say where we go always straight. Here it would have been better to take the right of the two lanes. Inside the city or in front of a traffic light, it's, um, it's not forbidden to choose left or right. But we are outside the city and behind the traffic light, there are two lanes going to the same direction. And by law, if you do not overtake someone, you have to take the rightest lane like on a highway if you are done with overtaking a truck for example and there's a big spot on the right side you have to move your car back to the right side but that's not only a highway rule that's uh, outside the city rule and we are outside the city and because the driving school is not always the fastest uh, vehicle on the road it's sometimes difficult to get a spot back on the right side you see in the in the back camera that someone is a little faster but now he's slower <laughs> yeah and then you have overtaking people on the right side but he did not think about going to the right side and it was good because the examiner told uh, the student bitte links up being under ampel that's what we do now Oh, please turn right. Bitte rechts abbiegen. And this is a bypass. We are not in touch with the roundabout. We are passing it by. And the visibility is good. We can see that there's no one and we can drive out. Now there was a little cut because the engine was stalled, but no problem. Please turn around, bitte wenden, bitte umkehren. And there's a huge spot on the right side. So we have to stop and moving in reverse right side and then coming out to the left side. Bitte fahren Sie in den Kreisel und nehmen die zweite Ausfahrt. Zweite Ausfahrt. Second Exit. So left side is free, no one inside the roundabout, so we can enter and count. Number one. Number two. Then he said, don't drive too fast. We want to make the reverse parking. You see on the right side, the Audi car. We want to stop next to the Audi car and do the reverse parking here. Bitte halten Sie neben dem schwarzen Auto an und parken rückwärts ein. Auf 
I hope that this spot is big enough for you if you get such a huge spot for parking. So first attempt you can see uh, where half of the car is parked. The back camera is centered in the window so you could see that half of the car was in so he made correction number one forward correction number one of three by law there are only three corrections now he saw that it's a little bit far away from the curbstone and he made a little correction to the curbstone so he showed the basic uh, movements and he showed how to make correction and that's why this was enough for the examiner to see and to decide yeah that's good we can go on mirror indicator blind spot and we are back on track yeah we have some things to do. We need to see the high speed road, but if you have a look at the rest of the time we have in this video, you can probably figure out that we will not see the highway in this exam. Bitte links abbiegen. Right before left with the waiting lines on the ground. Nobody from the right side. Blind spot. Turn. Dead end means we need to turn around anyway. Then you see no entry signs left and right side and they painted it on the ground. That's why we have to turn here. Hey, we have to turn. Hey, hey. Oh. Another failed driving exam.